All right, Gast. You best be moving out, because old Steve is coming through. Huh. Ouch! Excuse me while I call my insurance. On the table, we have a mashup of Minecraft and Hot Wheels. Looks like the Minecraft minifigures will finally get to ride in style on the always smooth rolling Hot Wheels. This is the Ghast Attack track. On the back of the box, we have an image of the track layout, what it can accomplish. We have the all important pullback launcher, the traditional Hot Wheels loop for the minecart rail, and a large Ghast with eyes and a mouth that move. It looks like the first task is to launch through the loop to wake up the ghast, then to pass through again and open its mouth, and finally blast that ghast apart. Mattel is also thinking smart with the Hot Wheels Minecraft single carded minecart cars, so you can make sure that every one of your minifigures has a ride. And for those collector people, each card has a different character on the front here. This would be the Steve card. And there are six in this initial collection. We have Pig in a minecart. We have a Creeper in a minecart. We have a Zombie in a minecart. We have a Skeleton in a minecart. And we have Alex in a minecart. But pretty much all these minecarts I can tell are about exactly the same. Inside the box we are loaded down with a ton of track pieces of course. We've got a launcher with a rubber band keeping it simple. That should work pretty well. We've got, looks to be a nether portal to get to where we're going. And we've got giant pieces of ghast. A couple big chunks of ghast to put together. A switch track. And we have the little Hot Wheels cart with a zombie pig man. And so far I'm really liking the design of the minecart. We have a soft rubber top that grips the minifigure into the cart. Looks like it will be able to hold most to all of the minifigures, probably not the slime cube and a couple others, but it will hold most figures, I bet you. And it rolls just like you would expect a Hot Wheels to roll. What a great idea. The Ghast Attack Track is now built. Pretty easy overall in the construction. We have lots of letter guides going on in the track and in the instructions to help you out. Piecing together this massive ghast was pretty simple and lining up the rest of the track was pretty simple. It looks like they thought out this design really well. Of course that Lego Minecraft tree is sold separately. So there are three Ghast Attack features we must do. The first one is to wake up the ghast. Now you'll notice right away we have a switch up front and right now it is pointed straight at the loop, but you can also change this later by just shifting this back and forth. And that design is pretty clean. So we'll take our zombie pig man in cart, load him up onto the track. You can set this launcher for a power hit or a secondary hit. And once you get it ready, it'll click right into place. Move the car into position, and let's fire away. Keep your eyes on the ghast's eyes. It is awake. Now we're going to go for the second ghast attack. We are going to attempt to open its mouth. Keep an eye on the ghast's mouth or the horrible, horrible crash of the Pigman. Wow, he actually righted himself. That was bizarre. Okay, let's try it again. Here we go. 
and the mouth is open. Now for the final gas attack stage, rotate your launcher. Sometimes I like to set it before I place the car in, a little bit easier that way. And now for the final attack. Boom goes the gas. Pretty impressive feature. Let's try a few more angles and enjoy this thing. And that is the Minecraft Gast Attack Track playset. Pretty entertaining. I would say it functions most of the time. Every once in a while there is a horrific Hot Wheels crash, but that's the way these things play. You will get some mixed results on the various minifigures and minecarts. You just have to play around with it. I would suggest to look for the minifigures that close resemble the Pigman that came with the set. However, the Bulbous Gast did pretty good versus itself. Steve with the armor probably had the most mishaps, and this light chicken did some things too. Again, just play around with it and you will have loads of fun. The Hot Wheels Minecraft Gas Attack Track appears on store shelves end of summer fall 2016 for around suggested retail of $30. If you have been looking for a good system of minecart racing and crashing, Hot Wheels is the way to go as they are time tested in this sort of thing. And if you start with this track, you will enjoy a lifetime of gas attacking. That's what I have to say about that. The squirrels want to ride in the minecart. Thanks for watching Squirrel Stampede. Please like, share, subscribe.